Oh, I have an idea. One second. What's up, everyone? Welcome back to Here's the Thing. Here's the thing. Over the weekend, I saw an article by Catholic News Agency declaring that Pope Francis had declared a 14th century blind lay Dominican woman a saint. Apparently, now Saint Margaret of Castello was born blind, ended up becoming a third order lay Dominican woman, opened up a small school and taught children the Catholic faith, and was known for teaching the children psalms specifically, all of the psalms that she had memorized by heart. We won't go too much into Margaret of Castello today, but I was reading this article where it shared that Pope Francis had declared her a saint and how he had recognized other people for having and witnessing heroic virtues in their life. People who we have known that are modern day people and probably soon to be saints that have provided a great service to the church in building the kingdom of God right now. I was just really struck by this article, which we will link in the description box below, because it just reminded me once again how universal our church is. And not necessarily in the way that that word usually expresses, but that each of us are called to be saints. All of us are called to pursue holiness. And the way that that's done is so different and so unique from each other. It's, it's just wild. And it just got me thinking, how is he calling me to do that? And so now I ask, how is he calling you to do that? One of my favorite questions that I also think is over asked is, what will be on your saint card? Usually, sometimes at conferences or retreats or at mass or really anywhere, we'll come across saint cards and we'll have the saint's portrait on the front, either a prayer on the back or some information about their lives. And I always can't help but wonder what I would want mine to look like, what God wants mine to look like, what the Lord desires of you. That's obviously not something that I or really anybody else can really tell you, but it is something that you can be helped guided in. And hopefully you are getting that. And hopefully this video is a help to that and just a reminder that where you are right now is exactly where you need to be because the Lord wastes absolutely nothing and he will use where you are. He will use your life circumstances. He will use your joys. He will use your trials. He will use your victories. He will use your failures as a means to love and pursue him and to serve him and to serve this world and to grow in holiness and to get to him. Just wanted to assure you of that and to encourage you to take into consideration alongside me what you would want on your saint card. What is it that you want to be known for? What is it that you think God wants you to be known for? I would love to be like the patron saint of laughing or something. I, I wish I laughed more, but I'd love to laugh. So uh, just a fun little tidbit about me. So anyway, I hope you guys are having a great week so far. I hope you continue to have a great week. Thank you for stopping by. If you see this, make sure you give this video a thumbs up. Send it to your friends who need a few words of encouragement. Make sure you subscribe if you haven't already, and I will see all of you very soon. Stay holy, my friends. Bye.